Hey guys, welcome to So Aldo. On today's video, I am going to show you how I am going to decorate these bookcases right behind me. So the other day, I went to Target and I purchased these bookcases. They are fairly inexpensive and it fits my needs. So I decided to grab two of those and my husband actually helped me. Well, actually, he put it together for me. <laughs> it's very easy to put together. It only took him about like an hour to put it together, an hour or less. I'm not quite sure because I wasn't really helping, I was just watching him. Before we get started, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Hit the notification as well so you will get notified whenever I post a new one. With that being said, let's go ahead and get started. I already placed all the big pieces on the the bookcases so I have my Bernina sewing machine over there and I have my brother serger and my Juki right there the sewing machines there on the bottom because they are the heavy items I don't want them uh, bending the shelves because the heavy items are gonna go on the bottom and the rest are for decoration so let's go ahead and get started okay so the first thing I did was kind of group my decoration pieces on uh, right here so I have baskets here that are um, like organic colored and I have like my whatever that is you know like the floral and my, the tr trays and my decorative boxes right here and my little uh, knickknacks here and there sewing books right there I also chose a color scheme so the color that I'm going for is pink white and blue some neutrals like um, tan color like this basket and this placemat also metallic silver and gold finish so the printer is going to stay under the desk I know it doesn't look so pretty under there but it is functional so it will stay under the desk for now so the first thing I will do is put the big items on the bookcases such as the sewing machines and the boxes. As you can see, I am staggering the boxes. I don't want them to be close to each other. I want them separated throughout so I can spread out pink colors here and there. The next are my sewing books. You will see me move these books like a lot of times until I was satisfied. Also putting some family pictures and the paintings that was from my niece she actually gave it to my daughter but I thought it looks super nice here in my room because I needed that pop-up color on my bookcase I'm going to move I'm going to move this box here I move it over here I have this glass container here that I am planning to put my fabrics in so it's gonna go right here and then the teacup or the teapot I, you know I absolutely love teapot does it fit here it doesn't maybe I will move it here okay, I'm not liking this this is kind of crowded here From time to time, I kind of back away from the bookcase and looking at it from afar so I can easily see what needs to be moved and what needs to be adjusted.
Okay guys, we are done shopping. So we went to Target and TJ Maxx. I got a few decorative boxes for my sewing room. And what else did I get? I went to TJ Maxx the other day and I picked up these huge boxes. Looks perfect. Two new fabrics, and I thought it was super super nice here. And these are my, some of leftover fabrics that I thought it's coordinating with the color scheme that I'm going for. So I'm going to place it in here as well. And there it is. found these uh, this is a vintage like a blanket almost, almost or a, a topper I am going to use it as a rug just because it's just so brown in this room and I don't have funds to buy a white rug so I got this at a state sale last week for like $10 I'm going to use it as my carpet rug and I thought it looks so so nice so yeah also going to put my mannequin back on its corner so that is the completed project today I absolutely love how it turned out um, I think it looks so organized and still very pleasing to look at. So this is the final product. I absolutely love how it turned out. I thought it looked so nice and clean and also very stylish. I love how it is um, aesthetically pleasing to look at. If you enjoyed this, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification so you will get notified whenever I post a new video. I'm going to provide all the links to the products that I showed today, especially the bookcases and the desk. And check that out if you are interested in any of the items that I showed here. Some of them obviously doesn't have links just because I purchased them a long time ago. But I will try my best to find something similar for you guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye!